know if you guys can see this pearl there. Hey guys, welcome back to MB's Hamsters, and today I'm going to be talking about boredom breakers for hamsters. So I am going to be making a few DIYs for my hamsters that is going to show you how to have less boredom with your hamsters. So I think that anyone who owns a hamster or has owned hamsters can all agree that hamsters get bored very easily. Um, hamsters, they want to come out, they want to play, and you often will find them chewing on objects and running around their cage because they're really bored. So I am going to be showing you some hacks about how to not keep your hamsters from being bored. So without further ado, let's go start the video. So the first way to keep your hamster from becoming bored and I found this very useful is um, to scatter feed your hamster, which is taking their seed mix and sprinkling it around the cage so they have to forage for their food. Foraging is a great boredom breaker and most hamsters seem to really enjoy it. I know both of my hamsters are 100% scatter fed hamsters and it really keeps them occupied at night and it keeps them from becoming bored. Another great forage toy is flax, wheat, and oat sprays. My hamsters seem to really love them, especially sugar. Um, dwarf hamsters especially seem to really like sprays, but again, it is for foraging and I really enjoy them and they look really nice in natural cages. They are also a good healthy snack. So now let's get into the DIY part of this video. First you're going to need some seeds and a toilet paper roll. So this is one of those forage ball toys and you're going to have to start off by cutting the uh, toilet paper roll into strips. My scissors were very dull as you can see and I was really struggling trying to cut this and it eventually did explode <laughs> so yeah but you just need to cut as many strips as you can until your whole thing is cut up into strips next you are going to need to squish them because they'll look a little bit like leaf shapes and you want them to look like circles so just uh, squish them until they're circular and then you can overlap them and turn them into a more uh, ball shape. So you can keep overlapping them until it is harder to get the seeds out until there's no big gaps for the seeds to fall out. I was also struggling with this part. <laughs> so eventually I got all of the strips wrapped around and then you need to stuff through the little gaps uh, seeds so that your hamster has to tear apart and destroy the ball to get the seeds out. So now you're done and you're ready to give this to your hamster. <laughs> For the next one, you're going to need a toilet paper tube, some seed mix, and a little bit of shredded toilet paper. Next, you are going to need to push the sides of the toilet paper tube in, and then pinch the corners so that it stays shut. This is to keep the seeds and the toilet paper inside of the tube. Next, you need to stuff the toilet paper tube with nesting, aka shredded uh, toilet paper, and then you add in a little bit of your seed mix, and you just keep repeating this until your toilet paper tube is full. 
So it will be a layer of nesting seeds, nesting seeds. And then you pinch the top closed, just like you did at the beginning. So this one is probably one of the easiest ones that I have here for you guys. And all you need is some corrugated cardboard. You can get this mostly with IKEA furniture. And you need some seed mix because hamsters love food. So seed mix is a great uh, thing to keep them from being bored. So as you can see, I'm ripping off the top layer of the corrugated cardboard. And this should leave a honeycomb pattern on the bottom of it. So now you just need to fill this up with your seed mix and your hamster will have a lot of fun digging and scratching at the corrugated cardboard. As I said, this is very easy as all you're doing is just ripping off a layer of cardboard. So this one is being filmed in a different part of the day because I accidentally filmed this video sideways before. So, um, yeah, I'm refilming it. <laughs> so this one is very simple. All you need is a willow ball and some of the oat sprays or any sprays that you have. And you just shove it into the willow ball and it creates a really cute a really cute looking um it almost looks like a plant with a plant pot is what it looks like to me but a lot of hamsters will enjoy ripping and tearing at the um at the sprays you can also even take it a step farther where you add food to the willow ball as well as the sprays so then they have a double treat and they can really forage into the sprays to get their seed mix out so yeah that basically wraps up today's video guys and i hope you guys enjoyed it i know it's very hard to have uh, your hamster not be bored but I hope these hacks have helped you and your hamster from becoming less bored so I'll see you guys again soon bye guys